your favorite mirror, baby, and I'm back with another freaking banger. So today, y'all, mm -mm -mm, today, your girl is going home. I haven't been home since Thanksgiving. Y'all count those months up. Count them up for me. December, January, February, March, April, May. And we in June. That's seven months. Seven months, I think it's seven months. But I'm going home today. My parents do not know. Only a few people know that I'm coming home. So I'm, this is the plan or whatever. So I um, booked my little bus tickets or whatever. Shouts out to Red Coach. This is not a sponsored video, FYI. But so I'm going to go home. I'm going to make it home. I leave at 6.30. I'm going to make it home at like 2 something in the morning. And my cousins are going to be picking me up. And my little sister also. Or whatever. They're going to be picking me up from the bus station or whatever. And I have my own house keys to my house back home in West Palm Beach. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get dropped off to my house. And I'm going to unlock the door. Yes, I'm going to walk right in. And I'm going to walk right in my mom's room. And I'm going to stand over her while she's sleeping. <laughs> my mom going to slap the piss out of me. <laughs> but nah. So yeah, I'm going to surprise my parents. My dad is not going to be home at the time. Because he don't get home till like 8 something in the morning. So I'm surprising them at two different times. So there will be two different reactions. Don't Let's get them. But whatever. It's going to be two different reactions or whatever. And I'm really nervous. I'm not going to cap. Like, I just feel like my parents going to look different. <laughs> Even though I text them every day, but I still, like, none of my family knows. So, I'm going to vlog from tomorrow. To, I'm going to vlog up to tomorrow or whatever with my parents. And then I'm, gonna, I'm not going to upload it until next week because I want to actually get my response. Uh, I want to get the reactions of my family members when I go to church on Sunday also because they don't know that I'm coming too. So it's going to be like a lot of different reactions all in one video. And I'm going to upload that. So I'm about to take me Once I'm getting ready to leave, I'll be Guys, I'm about to board the bus. Yes. With my bougie ass. So happy, so excited. to my house I text my mom and was like woke up out of my sleep my chest is hurting and I can't go back to sleep so my mom now has like chronic I have very bad asthma so like when stuff like this happens like when I have an episode or whatever I have to get rushed to the hospital or whatever so uh my little sister recorded me talking to her asking her like what medication I should take or whatever she told me to take aspirin and I had made up like the milligrams on it so she was like send that to me so now she's constantly blowing up my phone I can't even get the video in to record it because she keeps calling me and texting me so I'm on my way to my house and we're about to be here and yes I'm about to knock on the door and when she opened the door I'm gonna just be like is these cuz she wanted these prison shebang chips so I'm gonna be like does this look like 60 milligrams and she's gonna shit bricks <laughs> So right now, y'all probably like, girl, what are you doing? So right now, I'm listening to see if someone's coming downstairs to unlock the door. Because I usually can tell, like, if someone's coming downstairs. But the whole entire time, my mom was literally in bed. Like, she wasn't even coming downstairs. So here we go again, having to change the plans on what we got to do. I thought I heard something, but I didn't. So now, Shanice came up with the plan of her keep knocking and sitting on the porch and then frightening hey, my mommy. mom when she opened the door and just be like, 
And she may have called me saying something about her having asthma. And she's not responding to my text messages anymore. So let's see how this goes.